Yep. You know? So a few things like that that we could we could set aside. They weren't showstoppers or safety critical items. Young, and I saw you guys back there working. I think I was about 15. I saw you guys back there working. I said, what are you guys doing? So we're working on this engine. Told me a little bit about it. I think I talked with Steve first. Wow. Told me a little bit about it. So well, can I join? And then I, I think I went to work that week and just kind of came back every week after that. For he, he, was, he was floored when he got the answer. Yes, sure you can. I was excited. Hang <laughs> on your seats.
they were fairly up and got sold at auction. Yeah, it was really fast, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I wore a cowboy boots in Vegas, so I won't do that. I ever do that again. <laughs> My feet were so sore. I didn't know. time I saw that when I wrote this because I was totally what was expected. Yeah. Alright now I figure when we're riding on the train it's only fitting that we get at least one really good train song that just gets you in the mood for being on the train and with it being in this particular train car it doesn't get any better than that. There you go. This is called City of New Orleans. Yes. Riding on the city of New Orleans, Illinois Central, Monday morning rain. Fifteen cars and fifteen restless riders, three conductors and twenty-five sacks of mail. And all along the southbound Odyssey, the train pulls out a cake of key and rolls along past houses, farms, and fields. And trains that have no name, and freight yards full of old black men, and graveyards of rusted automobiles. Singing good morning, America, how are ya? Say, don't you know me? I'm your native son. I'm the train they call the city of New Orleans, and I'll be gone 500 miles when the day is done. Setting right now, that's what all these tarps are. 
And this is going to be a coach storage building. Um, the other side is 100 feet wide and 300 feet long. It goes down to where that equipment is, basically, um, and back to the back. And it will be against this wall of the shop. It will have five cracks, so we'll be able to put 15 cars, store 15 cars in, and a lot of other stuff. Well, that's a big improvement. Yeah, well, we need it very badly. Four thousand dollars spent on the restoration of this. So not quite what you can do with the It's pretty close to the to the What about the Before he came home, we had bought it. 